In this question, we are asked to calculate the average of all the three digit terms which are part of the arithmetic progression 38, 55, 72 and so on. Whenever you are asked to calculate the average of an arithmetic progression, the easiest way to calculate the average is to calculate the first term and calculate the last term and take their average. The average of an arithmetic progression is the average of the first term and the last term. This arithmetic progression is 38, 55, 72 and so on. So the difference is 17. So each term of this arithmetic progression is of the form 17 into k plus 4. Because 38 is 34 plus 4. 34 is a multiple of 17. Then you add 17 to it. 55 will come. 55 is 51 plus 4. Then you get 72. 72 is 68 plus 4. So every term is of the form 17k plus 4. What is the smallest three digit number which is part of this arithmetic progression? The smallest three digit number will be the smallest multiple of 17 is 102. So the smallest multiple will be 106. So we'll have 106 in it, then we'll have 123 in it, then we'll have 140 in it and so on. What is the largest three digit number which will be part of uh, this arithmetic progression? The easiest way to calculate it is find out a multiple of 17 uh, which is uh, close to 1000. The first thing that comes to mind is 17 into 60 which is 1020. So one number which is part of this arithmetic progression will be 1024. But this is a four digit number. So we'll remove 17 from it. We'll have 1007. This also is a four digit number. We'll remove another 17 from it. So the last three digit number will be 990. So the arithmetic progression which has only three digits will be 106, 123, 140, dot, 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 dot till 990. The average of this arithmetic progression is the average of the first term and the last term which will be equal to 106 plus 990 divided by 2. This is equal to 1096 divided by 2 which is equal to 548. So the answer for this question is 548. If you want more memory based questions and papers from past year's CAT exam, just go to Google and search Crack Your CAT Previous Papers.